Let ABC be an acute triangle with DEF, the feet of altitudes lying on line BC, CA and AB respectively. One of the intersection points of the line EF and the circumcircle is P. The lines BP and DF meet at point Q. We want to prove that the length AP is equal to the length AQ. This is a geometry problem from the 2010 IMO shortlist. Before we move on to proving this geometry fact, I want to point out that we do have two possible configurations in this problem, as the line EF can intersect the circumcircle at two possible points, P1 and P2, but we are going to use directed angles to enable us to only consider one of the case, and it will take care of the other case. If you have never heard of directed angles, I have made a video about it previously, do check it out if you need to. So let's just take one of the intersection points to be P and work with it to show that the length AP is equal to the length AQ. We shall use angle chasing to show that the directed angle of AQP is equal to the directed angle of QPA. Since using angles is a good way to show that two lengths are equal. Now because we are given that the points A, P, B and C lie on a circle, by the properties of a cyclic quadrilateral, we know that the angle QPA is equal to the angle BCA. Next, it is pretty well known that by the properties of the autocenter H, quadrilateral AFDC is a cyclic quadrilateral because the angles angle AFC is equal to the angle ADC which are 90 degrees. And in fact, AC is the diameter of the circumscribed circle of the cyclic quadrilateral AFDC. So, the fact that the quadrilateral AFDC is cyclic actually gives us the angle DCA, which is the angle BCA, is the same as the angle QFA. Therefore, we see that what we have just shown is that the directed angle of QPA is equal to the directed angle of QFA which also means that the quadrilateral AQPF is cyclic. Our problem now is actually equivalent to showing that the directed angle of AQP is equal to the directed angle of QFA, which is actually not hard to show. We notice that because the quadrilateral AQPF is cyclic, this implies the directed angle of AQP is equal to the directed angle of AFE. Then similarly, quadrilateral BFEC is also cyclic, as the angles BFC is equal to the angle BEC, which are 90 degrees. So, we have the direct angle of AFE is equal to the direct angle of BCE, which is the same as the direct angle of DCA. And this is the same thing that we have just worked off just now. That is, it is the angle QFA. And so the direct angle of AQP is equal to the direct angle of QFA, which means that the two direct angles AQP and QPA are indeed the same. Thus, this just means that the length AP is equal to the length AQ. If you have reached here, subscribe to the channel and turn on notification. Then click the video on the screen right now to watch what a direct angle really means. I will see you in that video.